Good morning, TBA, and welcome to Pause Live. I'm Blake. I'm Anna. And I'm Mrs. Herman. Today is of September 24th and a day two. Today for lunch we have chicken wing pizza. A message from Ms. Mr. Hirsch. We want you. Mr. Hirsch is looking for students who want to be part of the decision making and change in the high school. If you have ideas on how to better school and class environment and want to want a voice in the new rules and changes, to benefit the high school, stop in the office and sign up to be part of the school improvement team. We would like suggestions from you and your peers. The meeting will be held once a month for, from 2.40 to 3.30. If you are a senior, please check your mailbox in the guidance office for important information. Juniors, please vote on teams for your class officers. We still need about 12 votes. Please do this today. Voting will be closed as soon as at noon today. Congratulations to new, the newly elected senior class officers, President Nicole Burton, Vice President Olivia Payne, Secretary Michaela Tatlow, and Treasurer Mia Pavone. Remember, Spirit Week is next week. Monday is Movie Monday, Tuesday is Duo Squad Day, Wednesday is Country vs. Country Club, Thursday is Tacky Tourist, and Friday is Blue and Gold. Get dressed up and show your class spirit. Great job to the sophomore team beating the freshmen 24-0 with Olivia lighting up on both sides of the ball. And can't forget about the seniors with a great game against the juniors with a last minute 40-yard run, 40 yard run by Taryn Herman to get the seniors a game-winning touchdown 32-24. to The Harvest Dance is October 2nd from 6.30 to 8.30 for the 6th and 8th graders. We will have the dance behind the high school on the practice field. Speaking of dances, homecoming is right around the corner. To all of the freshmen through seniors who want to have a guest from another school come to our dance, they need to fill out a permission form, and 6th through 8th graders are not allowed to have guests at this time. If you are going to a dance at another school, you'll have to make sure that you get a permission form from the other school. If there are any questions, you can go to the main office and see Mrs. Warner or Mrs. LeBrand for help. Do you want to read the announcements? Go to TBA website to sign up. Just just click on the 10 Brook Academy tab, then choose Pause Live. Remember, backpacks should not be carried to classes or th throughout the day. Even though if you even if you are leaving early, your backpack should stay in your locker until you are dismissed. And now a special announcement from Mrs. Herman. Thank you for listening. Frederick Taxia FA is a rare genetically inherited disorder. It manifests itself in the form of a progressive impairment of muscle coordination, or another term, ataxia, loss of muscle strength and sensation in impaired speech, vision, and hearing. This disease is a characterized by a slow progression and, in general, rather poor prognosis. Individual prognosis depends on many factors, including specific genetic changes behind the condition, the age of the disease, the onset, the severity of the symptoms, and the presence of the illnesses. Life expectancy in general, the age of this disability onset correlates with life expectancy. People with earlier onset disease tend to manifest more severe in the symptoms and uh, die younger. Most FA survive until the ages of 40 and 50. Although life expectancy varies significantly depending on the severity of the symptoms, please tend to have milder symptoms. Finally, today there are many young lives that are affected by Frederick's ataxia. There's a bulletin board on the downstairs, if you could take a look on the first floor. These individuals are schoolers that live with us every day. I even have uh, four of them, if you could take a look, and one that I'm related to. For more information on Frederick's ataxia, please go to www.curefa.org. And thank you for listening about this important message. And uh, tomorrow is Frederick's Ataxia Awareness Day. Uh, remember, it's now required to keep your mask on up at all times and up over your nose and have a great day.